Hey guys, welcome to your 17th Lua GUI scripting tutorial, and today I'm going to show you guys a property called Anchor Point. I haven't made a GUI tutorial in a while. I guess there's not that much to show you guys in terms of properties and concepts anymore, so I might make uh, specific vi or videos on specific things called, uh, or no, I mean just specific topics, like a spectate GUI or something. I don't know, but uh, I'm going to show you a new property that Roblox introduced, and it's called Anchor Point. Let me get a frame out uh, in the middle of the screen, or close to the middle at least. Okay, so you see this little box right here with the black border? that is new so that is your GUI elements anchor point right now it's at zero zero by default which is what it's always been at or uh, as in if you don't alter the property it won't affect anything yet in terms of well what it does I need to, I'm better off showing you so I'm gonna change it to point five point five now you see that little box is in the middle of our GUI frame. Change it to 1-1 one, one, and now it's at the bottom right corner instead of the top left. So our GUI's anchor point is at the top left by default like it's always been. And changing it basically means it changes the way it's positioned and sized. So right now look at how I change its position from 0.3 scale to 0.4 change the anchor point you see it doesn't move the same way because it moves by the anchor point um, so explaining the use of this that's pretty much the use you can use it in whatever way you want I know one cool use of this is uh, something my friend helped me realize the other day uh, script dot parent tween size Item two dot new uh, point two point two or zero point two zero out sign uh, point five. Uh, wait, what did it? Okay, I tween position. No, I'm gonna wait one so I can load in first. So this property will help you uh, tween your GUIs from the middle of them which you had to do some weird thing with tween size and position to do previously but now it's a little bit easier it can help you make a cool effect cooler uh, script up here about mouse center connect function So yeah, that's the usefulness of it, or one usefulness of it anyway. Okay, that's a little prettier. So yeah guys, have fun playing around with this property. I'll probably upload an intermediate tutorial next within a few days, so I'll see you guys next time. 